Hello and welcome to ASTA, I'm Udelvi Hill. If you're a business owner or you're looking to start a new business, the upcoming Business Boot Camp could be a huge help to you. And here to tell us more about the Business Boot Camp are Tom Hutchison, who, along with his wife Doreen, owned La Posta Restaurant and Hacienda de Mesilla, and Jed Fanning, President and CEO of Citizens Bank. Gentlemen, thank you for your time. Glad right to be here, Udelvi. Good to be here. Jed, let's start with you. What is the Business Boot Camp? Well, I see it as a private-public partnership event. Uh, the public piece of that is the City of Las Cruces organizes and coordinates and schedules the event. And then we have a keynote address and three or four panelists uh, at the event. And those panelists are made up of people in the community that either own or operate a business and have an expertise in the particular topic that we're dealing with in that particular boot camp. And that's really the private part of it is to have actual business owners and operators uh, attend. And uh, our objectives really, uh, it's twofold. One is we want to create value for the attendees, uh, give them an opportunity to not only hear from the panelist and the keynote speaker, but also to ask questions. Uh, we like to have it as informal and as interactive as possible. And then the second part of the objective is really around creating an awareness. Uh, and uh, what we hope to find is that uh, it's tough to, to solve all of the problems and issues that may come up, but we hope to create an awareness where there may be issues that after the business boot camp, uh, whether it be the city or the business community, uh, can uh, have issues that need some extra attention. Wonderful. And what roles will you and Tom play in the boot camp? Well, uh, Tom has been involved in the boot camp from the outset. Uh, he does a good job of kicking off the event, really setting the stage and uh, setting the expectations. Uh, in our first boot camp, uh, he served as our keynote. And uh, with the upcoming boot camp in March, uh, Tom and I will be co-moderators. Okay. And Tom, as far as the topics, what, what uh, will you be covering? <clears throat> You know, uh, just to backtrack for a second, Udell, uh, when we did the first boot camp, the, uh, the topic that came to, to Jed in my mind, uh, first and foremost, was leadership and culture, which is so critical in, in business at all levels. So I think we covered that pretty well. And then in thinking about where we would go with our second boot camp, you know, the, probably the most mysterious uh, topic that uh, the $64,000 question for businesses is how do you spend your marketing dollar? And in today's environment, uh, you know, social media and the different uh, avenues we can go there. It's so fluid and dynamic. Uh, we felt uh, businesses would really benefit from a good, honest, candid discussion on that topic. And who are the panelists at, at this upcoming Well, I think Jed spoke to the keynote uh, uh, moderator uh, or keynote panelist, and that would be Dave Wilson this time. Dave Wilson has been a principal with Wilson Bankley. You probably know Dave for, yes. for many years now, the largest marketing agency in town. Um, I, I consider Dave one of the smart guys. He, uh, he's really, his, he and his company and his colleagues are really up on, on uh, what's working in the marketing world. He's got a variety, a large variety of, of customers that spread over various industry types. So I think sharing, uh, getting Dave to share some of his experiences and where some of these industries are going with their social media dollars, their marketing dollars, you know, we're not seeing a lot of print anymore. Um, and, and I can tell you that personally. Uh, we're shifting you know, some of our resources more in the social media realm. But what does that mean? And you know, someone like Dave will be able to share with us statistics and what's working for some of his customers. So I think everyone will benefit from his, uh, his experiences and wisdom. Yeah, quite a wealth of information is going to be available at this. Right. Jed, who, who do you recommend attend this boot camp? Well, I, I think it would be a, a combination. Uh, it would be those that own or operate businesses currently. And it could also be people that are interested in uh, starting your own business. Uh, I, I think we value entrepreneurship. Uh, I mean, that's a big part of our community here that we all love to, to live and work in. And so uh, we would see it as a combination between those that are already in business that want to learn more and those that, uh, again, may be looking to put a shingle out and, and start a business of their own. Great. And when, where will this uh, upcoming boot camp take place? Um, <clears throat> in the next month, and if I, if I can go back to the panelist Certainly. real quick, uh, you know, as I mentioned, Dave will be the key guy, uh, and we're looking forward to having him join us, but there'll be three other folks joining okay. us. 
Uh, two of them are downtown vendors right now. You have uh, Ariana Parsons, who's the co-owner with Tyrell Thacker of Bex Coffee. You know uh, Ariana. And then Teresa Del Berdeen, who, uh, who just uh, opened up her little uh, Little Toad Bre uh, Creek Brewery and Distillery. She was in Silver City for many, still is in Silver City for many years, uh, but has had her location here in Las Cruces now for about a year on Main Street. And then the, uh, the third person will be Isabella Petticone, who's the marketing director for Sinuate Marketing, who specializes in social media and uh, emails and, and everything we're trying to figure out in the business community regarding social media. Oh, wow, quite a talented panel. Yeah, it's a, it's a good group. As to when the uh, event is, March 12th, it's a Tuesday. We're going to have it uh, at La Posta. Uh, get, you know, Great. surprise there. Uh, 11.30 to 1.30, uh, we'll be offering lunch. Uh, free of charge, and seating will be limited. Uh, the Economic Development Department, the city, will be reaching out to businesses shortly to uh, to identify how to register, and, and okay. so more word will be passed on uh, here shortly on, regarding that. Okay, very good. Any last, uh, last minute thoughts, either of you? I, I guess I would just offer up that uh, I think for any of us that are involved in, in business, it's uh, always important to listen and learn and I think this is an opportunity for people to come in with an open mind and uh, possibly think outside the box a little bit. I think we're all guilty. I, I know I am of getting in our routines mm -hmm. and there's always some value in hearing different perspectives and as you've heard from Tom with this set of panelists, we'll, we'll get some uh, variety of, of different ideas and perspectives. Terrific. Well, it sounds great, and I hope a lot of people take advantage of it. There's certainly a, a wealth of information available to them. Tom, thank you, Dale. Thank you so much. Appreciate Jim. the opportunity. Thank you, thank you for coming by. Appreciate yes, it very much.